Hello, hello, it's Sam and welcome back to my channel. Um, this is kind of like a weird setup right now. I just got done filming one video, but today I'm going to be showing you guys my vanity. So where I do my makeup every day, um, I'll be showing you my makeup collection and how I made my vanity, the whole setup, all of that. So yeah, I think I'm just going to get started. Alright, so to start off, I'm just going to go over the vanity part of it. My vanity top is honestly just from Menards. It's just like a slab of wood pretty much. It didn't have like a glossy finish, but it was painted white already. And so I honestly just got that. It's a pretty long one. I think it's like, it's pretty long. But I just ended up getting some Michaels um, like rip off Ikea Alex drawers. Maybe not the Alex ones. I think those are the tall ones. But yeah, the five drawer things. It's pretty much a rip off of Ikea's but I got them from Michael's. I had to put them together. All that. So um, yeah those are those. I just bought two of them and literally just set the um, tabletop on top of it and called it good. <laughs> and then my mom made me this mirror. Sorry you can sometimes see some of the cords hanging out but my mom made me this mirror. It's just a black mirror and she literally just like drilled in holes and put in light bulbs there. I have been looking on Amazon for a new one. Just one that's a little bit bigger and doesn't have such a wide black thing around it. I don't know. I've just been kind of looking but for now this one really, works really well. I do have to plug it in every single day underneath there. I'll show ya. It's probably gonna mess up the whole lighting but it is pretty bright. So yeah, I think I'm just going to show you guys what is on the side here. I did get these little um, shelving unit things from Amazon. They're just floating shelves. They're like the 2 inch whatever ones and I just put them in myself. I don't know if they're completely even but I did it myself <laughs> and I just kind of wanted to have some shelving here just to showcase some of my stuff. So that's what I did. So this first shelf I just have a whole crap ton of perfumes pretty much. Got some KKW Simply Pink by Aquafina. Um, these, this little thing from Walmart honestly. They, they smell amazing. I have my Bella Vince Camuto, my go-to every day. I have a whole bunch of scent bird back there. They end up falling all the time so I'm not going to touch those. Viva La Juicy just like this little guy. I have Viva La Juicy Gold Couture and my Daisy Love. So I just have a whole bunch of perfumes that just sit there. I do end up wanting to kind of like organize it and update it a little bit, get rid of some of these smaller ones and just get some bigger ones. Yeah, so that's my perfume. I just have three pairs of sunglasses up here, nothing too crazy. And then up top here I just have an assortment of nail polishes and then this little sign that says get lost in the right direction. Sorry, this is probably like really awkward, but... This is what I came up with and it's gonna work. <laughs> it's not centered. I just have this lip sign thing so so starting on the top since I already have it facing up here I just have an assortment of little brushes that I don't really use anymore those just sit here this is just burlap or um sorry twine around a jar and just like this little mesh thingy and then here is a painting that I painted of just eyebrows eyes and some splatters I did that myself <laughs> and then here I have a crystal that I got from Medora when I was there with with my friend. It's really heavy. <laughs> and then I have the Jaclyn Hill lipsticks and then this one little highlighter that I have. Yes, I know it's Jaclyn Hill lipsticks, but I still use them and I still like them. So, And then over here I just have um, a couple different like skincare things. My lip mask, lip scrub. I have a pair of lashes. Blinking Butte lashes. It comes in this really cute box. So, And then I have this Juno & Co sponge that came in this cute little thing. I just keep those there and then I have a candle plant and then some products that I have yet to test out that I keep there. Moving on to down here, I'll try not to make it too glary, but I have just a towel sitting here that I do my makeup on. Um, I have my Juno & Co Miracle Cream. I, this is just something I have out because I use it every day. Got some Q-tips, my mirror, a couple sponge or uh, cotton rounds, and then my brushes. So this is Pretty basic, this is where I do my makeup every day, so it's going to be practical, you know? So first I'm going to go into the left side of the drawers first. My top drawer is all of my um, eyeshadow type things. I'm just going to dig in right away. This is my new Huda, Huda Beauty little palette here. Dose of Colors, pretty cool palette. Violet Voss, Essentials palette. Got a little e.l.f. palette. Ugh, that one's not going to open. This Protein. Protege, I don't know how to say it, palette. Um, the Morphe and Manny Emmy Way. I got the whole Vault collection by Morphe and Jacqueline. 
And I got the Jacqueline Morphe, the James Charles Morphe, um, the M or 350M palette. This is just a whole bunch of mattes. I got the Studio Makeup on the Go eyeshadow palette. My mom got me this. It's actually really nice. I don't know where she got it from. ColourPop Fame, Pure Cosmetics. This is the Festival palette. I got a couple Tarte ones. Ooh, I knew it. My Morphe one, the matte one, it broke and so it's kind of all over the place. I got, ooh, some Tarte ones like I was saying that I believe I both got from BoxyCharm. So, got the Butter London Natural Goddess palette. And then my first ever high-end-ish like Sephora palette. And this is the Tarte Pro one. It is destroyed and pretty gross. So, I'm going to put these back now. I honestly don't know how I did this last time. <laughs> and then I have this little drawer on the side here. It's just got a whole bunch of like little knick-knacky things. It's got a lot of like single eyeshadows, eyeshadow primers, loose highlights, a blush stick, some little loose highlighter stuff, a little bronzer. Just kind of a lot of my stuff that I got from like Ipsy. I'm not really going to go into depth on that just because I don't go on this thing too often unless I want like a couple glitters and stuff but next I got my face drawer I guess you could call it yes I have a bazillion beauty blenders <laughs> um, I just bought like all of these Juno and Co ones just recently from Black Friday so so here I have my face setting sprays I have an elf hydrating coconut mist I have a morphe continuous setting spray and the iconic London prep set and glow one and here I have my Z palette with some of my highlighters bronzers blushes eyeshadows just a bunch of single stuff here I have the BH cosmetics um, studio pro palette the cheek parade palette I have the Alamar cosmetics blush trio this little highlighting palette from the balm this concealer thing from l'oreal paris my revolution bronzer mega bronzer the jaclyn hill becca collab got the tardis pro glow has some cover effects morphe bronzer morphe um trio blush thing this wander beauty little thing and then some elf things so I do come in here a lot for my beauty blenders, obviously, and then my setting sprays, because I have to. So there's that. <laughs> the third drawer here is all of my lipsticks and lashes. <sighs> I have an abundance of lip products, and I don't even really wear lipstick all that often. Like, not a, it's not an everyday thing. <laughs> but it's pretty overflowing. Here's a lot of my newer stuff that's kind of on top here. I'm just going to start with my lashes over here. I have some Lily Lashes in Houston, LA, and I'm not sure what these are. And then I have some Red Aspen Lashes, Lily Lashes in Diamond, these Lashaholics in Instaglam. Some Ardell ones, Eiler and Jasmine. Got some Ardell ones back there. Um, oh boy. Okay, so here I just have a lot of my liquid lipsticks and lip glosses, like the long ones, and then here I got some like shorter little things, like minis. And then in this little compartment here, I got all my lip liners and like my like bullets. The thing with this is I'm gonna start taking my bullets out and keeping them in like a thing up here, but I ordered it from Amazon, so it should be here soon. I don't know if I should go over all of this because it's so much, but I got some Maybelline, Milani, Revlon, more Revlon. Um, I got an e.l.f. one. I got Anastasia. I got these three Maybelline ones, and then I got MAC here. I got those. I got a whole bunch of lip liners, which I used to never... Oh, there's my thing. I was looking for that little sample things. So I got um, Lord & Berry. This is Milani. Okay, I got NYX. I don't like that one. I don't like that one either. <laughs> I got NYX, Kylie. Um, I'm just doing a decluttering here, I guess, too. Dirty Little Secret. I'm not quite sure where I got that. I think it was from BoxyCharm. Uh, I got Aveda, Red Aspen, Elf, um, Colourpop, Red Aspen, I got this NYX Line and Load, uh, this is Maybelline, this is MAC, Colourpop, NYX, NYX, and NYX, and then I'll put these here, and then I put these little sample things, these are samples of the um, Anastasia lipsticks, ugh, my back. Alright, so for these, I have a lot, 
So I have these two Ofra ones that I like got in my box of charm and they really don't use. So I think I'm gonna, oh my God. So I think I'm gonna like declutter these. I should have called this a decluttering video, honestly, but I wanna get rid of those. So I'm gonna take those out. I'm gonna try to go through these. I, it won't be perfect, but. All right, so I got ColourPop, ColourPop, Anastasia, and ColourPop, Anastasia, and ColourPop. And then I got some BH Cosmetics, DLS. This is Physician's Formula. I got some Lunar Beauty. Got some Kylie. Got some more BH Cosmetics. Bare Minerals, Milani, Kaylin, um, Lemonade. This is the Dominique collab, I think. Milani. We got some Jordana, Maybelline, Tarte, Bare Minerals, Revlon. So those are kind of like the bigger ones. I got some more Maybelline I see back here that I was going to use for... Um, a Halloween look, but I never did. Uh, this is something weird from BoxyCharm. Lip Brulee. I don't know where it's from. Not sure. I got some Morphe. This is a Mark. This is my first ever high-end lipstick. This well, it's a lip gloss. Mark Jacobs. So I've got some more Maybelline here. Um, I got some NYX Wet n Wild Dose of Colors. NYX Butter Glosses. Wet n Wild as well. More Wet n Wild. This is a gloss. I got Trust Fun Beauty. A whole bunch of Morphe and Jeffree Star Twisted Kisses. I don't know. And this, these are a whole bunch of Bare Minerals lip glosses. This is a Mana. I don't know what this is. <laughs> Mac gloss. Lip gloss, sorry. These NYX things. Three of those. And then this is Smashbox and Tarte. Oh, I forgot to go over these two. I have some weird glosses that I had in this one, but I put away to talk about and I forgot to talk about them. <laughs> Honestly, I go in the store often for the lip liners and glosses. That's like all I wear. I wear gloss all the time. Oh, now that I'm going through all these, they all look like the same color. But whatever. I don't like to use those. So I'll put it back there. Okay, this color is beautiful. This is the Ultra Satin Lip with Kathleen Lights and ColourPop. But I like don't know where to wear it. I should really declutter. Like I don't use that either. Alright, so that is my lip and lash drawer. Next, this is um, just kind of a whole bunch of little things that I need, I guess. So we got some cotton rounds, and then underneath that I have a whole bunch of like little face razors. And then behind here I have little wedges, like face sponges and disposable mascara wands for when I do people's makeup. A whole bunch of like sample stuff, so this living proof shampoo conditioner, which I'm going to take out because I want to use. Some Vanish Hourglass Foundation. This root touch-up stuff that I actually do use. And then some Jouer cream foundation samples as well. And then back here I just have some sheet masks. I'm not going to go over all of them. Here I have the micellar water. This is some cleaning brush spray. Brush cleaner swatch thing. Got these little things. When I do people's makeup, I do it so I don't touch their face with my pinky, if that makes sense. I got some Z palette little magnets. I got this thing for putting foundation on and mixing colors and stuff. Got these Line and Define eye tapes from e.l.f. And then a whole bunch of little things, as you can see. And yeah, so this drawer, I don't go in all the time. It's more of just like for this and cotton rounds and stuff. But the last drawer on this side is all of my nail stuff. So I have a whole bunch of fake nails. Um, a lot of them are red aspen and then a couple from like the drugstore and stuff. I got some acetone nail remover and a whole bunch of files and clippers and uh, cotton swa- uh, what are they called? Cotton balls. <laughs> now that they're not facing the right way, I'm like, it's driving me nuts. Can't believe I didn't fix that. Whatever. Okay. <laughs> I'm not going to close all of those, but yeah, this is my nail drawer. Just because my camera is already down here, I'm just going to start off with the bottom one on the right side. I moved over here now. This is kind of a mess. This is all of my brushes and hair ties scrunchies, headbands, combs, whatever. Bobby pins back here. I just got a whole bunch of stuff, but I do go in the store quite often, obviously, so this is kind of a mess, but yeah. This one is some of the hair products that I'm currently using. I have a whole nother huge container of hair products in this closet. <laughs> But I got some Detox Dry Shampoo, Pulp Riot, Texturizing Spray, got some hair sprays, um, leave-in conditioner, leave-in conditioner, got some dry shampoos, this little um, powder texturizing thing, leave-in conditioner, powder, leave-in conditioner, so a whole bunch of 
whole bunch of stuff, but I use this drawer every single day. All right, next, this is a whole bunch of skincare and moisturizers and all that good stuff. Um, I got some Drunk Elephant moisturizer, some retinol, eye gel, Lexly, <laughs> this little weird thing. I don't know where I got it. Glam Glow, some eye, eye stuff. First Aid Beauty Moisturizer, some moisturizer from Boxycharm that I got, and then I got back here my Neutrogena Hydro Gel. Love that, but I haven't really used it in a while. Got some makeup remover, like a face scrub, a scar thing, this mask. Got some night renewing serums from Rhode Island Fields, they're just like little capsules healing ointment stuff and then my Hazarac acne cream here I got a whole bunch of face masks here is the pure ex Barbie peel off mask I got the wonder beauty peel off mask this Elemis veggie mask hydrobiotic recovery sleeping mask by dr. brand this lash boost from Odin and fields um, derma e purifying coal charcoal mask Proactive toner, Hey Honey peel off mask, this First Aid Beauty bouncy mask, and then this little hair removal tool, which I'm actually gonna move over by my, um, over to like my hair removal area. Back here I got some Ole, 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 yeah, Ole face stuff, some Bum Bum cream back here, uh, Viva La Juicy lotion, Portico lotion, cake lotion, <laughs> hemp's. Barefoot Venus and Bath and Body Works. Some of these, like, I know this one and this one I got from, like, hotels just because they're that coconut lime verbena smell and I love that smell, so. And then here I got some Lennon Fields Lip Renewing, Lip Renewing Serum. This little macaroon, some cute balms, hey honey, shea butter lip thing, some chapsticks, hemp's, a whole bunch of lip stuff. So this drawer is used a little bit, mostly just for like masks and if I want to use like a different um, moisturizer, but I don't go in here a whole lot. I should more, but I don't because I, I honestly leave like all of my like lip stuff out that I use on a daily basis. Here are all my foundations and powders, mostly. Um, I got some airspun back here. I don't use that too much just because the smell just like bothers me. I got my Clinique Beyond Perfecting Foundation, my Milani Foundation, NARS, L'Oreal, e.l.f. Here's some e.l.f. drops. I got e.l.f. here. Got some IT Cosmetics, Smashbox, L'Oreal, L'Oreal, L'Oreal Mercier, L'Oreal, and Morphe. These are kind of like the squeezy tube ones I just put in here just because I feel like it's easier to fit right in there. Over here I got some face tape by Tarte, Collab, Maybelline Super Stay, got Maybelline Dewy Smooth, NYX Total Control Drops, a sample of Tau Tarte Found Concealer, and then all in here are my powders, bronzers, blushes, and stuff. Um, I got the Hydra Mist, Becca Powder, Elf Pressed Powder, Fenty Beauty, this little mirror. I got the City Bronzer by Maybelline, um, a Kylie Bronzer, Kylie Blush, Kylie Highlight, Maybelline Loose Powder, got some Nikki Tutorials Highlight, got a Maybelline Powder, two Clinique Powders, I got a Wet n Wild Blush, LA Colors Contour, got the Balm Blush, Tarte Blush, Laura Geller Highlight, Milani Blush, Juice Beauty Cream Blush, Jelly Highlighter from e.l.f., and then two Naked Cosmetics um, Powders, LA Colors Blush, where was I, um, Physician Formula Butter Bronzer, so I got a NYX Powder, and then two more Maybelline. This is just another shade of the Maybelline powder and then whatever, yeah. And then I got two Super Stay, or no, R Rimmel London Stay Matte foundations, which I thought I liked one day and then now I bought two shades and I don't really like, so those just sit back there. So obviously I use this drawer a lot. These are my go-to foundations right here and then a lot of, I use this every single day. I use my Fenty Beauty every day, so that's nice to have it just right here. And then my go-to drawer, it's kind of a mess, but it's got everything I need in here. So in here I got a lot of the primers that I use on the side, like that are in the little tubey things. I got one heck of a blot, No Porblum, Lumi, L'Oreal, Professional, Wonder Beauty, um, I don't know what that one is, and then more Touch and Soul. So those are everyday ones. Then I got some e.l.f. ones here that are just in like these little things here. Poreless putty one. So for concealers, I got Too Faced Born This Way, Too Color Pop here, Maybelline Super Stay, NARS, Benefit Boing, Infallible from L'Oreal, my Tarte, got some Becca, got some e.l.f., Catrice, Makeup Revolution, um, more Maybelline, Master Conceal, yeah. So I got concealers there, and then back here I just got a couple more 
primers that I don't really use. So here I got a lot of my um, eyeliners. Got some NYX, MEM Cosmetics, Ciate London, Pixi, something from BoxyCharm. I'm not sure. NYX, uh, Scone Cosmetics. Just a whole bunch of random stuff, elf, whatever, just a whole bunch of eyeliners. Like I said it before in some videos, I don't wear eyeliners that much. Here's my brows. Got some elf, NYX, Urban Decay, Morphe, Maybelline, Benefit, Anastasia, L'Oreal, NYX, Chella. Got my eyebrow tweezers in here. Got an elf duo brow, Anastasia, dip brow, this Olancombe little duo i think it's it's in the shade latte i think it's actually like an eyeshadow but i use it as eyebrow sometimes and then we've got the nyx tame and frame brow pomade thing so got my brows here then we got all of my lash stuff so we got some Too faced damn girl um Too faced better than sex they're honestly like the pro at mascaras Too faced <laughs> got some nick or uh, nars climax mascara Tarte Ego Boost, Lash Paradise, Too Faced Waterproof, Maybelline, Urban Decay, Maybelline, Roller Lash, um, Hank and Henry, Elf, Tarte, and then we got some lash glues. Um, got an eyelash curler, Kiss Lash Adhesive, and Tartist Lash Pro Adhesive. So those are my mascaras, and that is the end of my drawers. It is getting dark outside, so it's getting dark in here, so better hurry this up. I am almost done, but... Oh, one last thing I wanted to go over was just my seat that I sit on. It's this Target little um, poof thing, and it's like the perfect height, and it's super cute, so I sit on this every day that I do my makeup, and then I have just like a little fur rug on the bottom here that you probably saw in the video, but I got that from TJ Maxx, so... This is my hangout spot. This is where I do my makeup every day. And that's pretty much it. I hope you found this video entertaining. I feel like I have a lot of makeup, but I feel like I want a lot more makeup. So I need to definitely find some more space for it. I think I want to get some Ikea Alex drawers, like the really tall ones. Once we get rid of the spare bedroom, we're going to have a lot more room for stuff like that. So. so that is it for my vanity tour, makeup tour, makeup collection type video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on any more videos of me. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.